the cheapest coins on FIFA 22, guys, check out MulePactory.com and use the code OwenFIFA at checkout for a discount. You can see we do loads of different coins and they even sell players and they do comfort trade, guys. It's 100% safe, all legit, everything like that. There's loads of different things. And they also, guys, if you do want other games, they do do other games as well. I mean, you can look through it. There's a link in the description, guys. Check it out down below. Hey guys, we're going to open up a brand new video guys, so let me show you a good foot birthday method. If all things are well, the foot birthday should have dropped today, I won't be on, so I'm just going to show you guys a video. Obviously giving you some methods, what you can do during foot birthday, your top 5 methods um, that you can do obviously during the promo. So the first one's going to be getting these new foot birthday cards, so what we're going to do now is going to pretend that these cards are the foot birthday cards. So we're going to pretend that these are the new foot birthday cards that are out, like obviously they're not, but I can't show you it any other way. I'm going to look at the strikers of these foot birthdays. So let's see, let's see Raspadori now. He'll be a cheaper one. So that this pretend he's like a cheap one of the new foot birthdays. You want to put him in here, and you want to basically find his price. Let's say the cheapest one is 30k, um, 32k. Yeah, 32k. So yeah, realistically 32k. You want to go to midfield now, and you want to see if there's any up in these positions. But obviously there is in these, but there won't be basically there won't be these positions, um, like taken up realistically straight away so what happened here is they'll be really rare if you want to find these 30k sort of 40k ones that are strikers and basically convert them to cam and centre mid and sell them on for 10k profit so that's the first method i'm going to show you it's the only method i'm going to show you where i'm not actually using the foot birthday cards and the other four methods guys the first one i'm going to think is going to be really good on the day is people are going to be opening packs and then obviously people are going to be getting the players in the club and they're going to then realize they've already got some of the players and they're going to list them up so First method here for me would be this, so 1.7k, go to 2k in the gold rare hunter. I'd just drop it back down to 1.8, see if anything's there. I mean, straight away, I know it is a deal. He's also about 3.5k, so that's the first thing straight away. You'd just be sniping these, though. Obviously, right now, if you look, it's 4.24am, so I'm just making this video quickly before I actually go out. Um, so you're going to be starting off here now with this. You want to put in, like, 1.6 and just sit and refresh and buy every single card that comes up. If that isn't working for you, you want to go and do something very similar, but this time you want to put in here... You want to put attacker or forward and then hunter and you'll see here at 2.1k there shouldn't be many maybe a page yes it's all the same sort of players as well so you want to look basically for left mids and left wings that are going for this sort of price the way i sometimes do it is this so i'll go left mid uh, right mid check these positions now we've got saka and rafinha and then we go to right wing we check these we've got a few other guys here porto and lozano and then we have in left wing we have Podense. So what I'll do is I'll go to Lozano here. I'll clear that. I'll put Hunter back in, and I'll go all the way up to like five k, four k. See how many are up. We know that isn't a deal there. We then go to Saka and do the same thing. So put in S A K, Saka. We're looking for k. You'll see this is now a deal because there's no other ones at four k or less. So we know that they will sell them for at least four k, probably more. Um, if it's up to 5, 6k, there might be none. So there's no sackers up to 7k, which has proved it's a really good deal. Uh, Pedense here might be another one that's pretty similar, but unfortunately not. Um, but yeah, that's the sort of thing you want to do. And um, that's the second method. Just keep searching these different players in. You can see Poor 2 isn't a deal. The third method here is going to be Gold Rare, and it's going to be Defender and Shadow. So a similar sort of story again. But this time 2.2k, check the cheapest, there's two up. Rulerson here now, you want to go and check both of these. So you want to go and check Rulerson up real quickly here. Go to like 4.2, check the next cheapest. You can see that's definitely a deal. He'll sell for 3.5k easy. That was a really easy deal. And Marcelo, I know sells for more usually, but whether he still goes for that now is a different story. So I'm going to check him again. He's 80 rated. Marcelo, 4.2k. Yeah, we can sell him for like 4k. So again, just straight away, you want to basically find the cheapest ones, check them, and keep doing this. Obviously, they'll keep coming up more and more as time goes on throughout the um, day. So just look now, I mean, look at the cheapest defenders here. They're like 2 8 which is the standard price. And I always just refresh, basically, on these guys and just do the sniping like this. You would sit and just refresh in and out like that. But what I'd then do is go to midfielder and just check out some of the CDMs that are up for 2.7 around that. If there's anyone that takes you fancy, have a look. I mean, you can check Camavinga. I don't know what he actually goes for. But, um, we'll check him at like 4.7. So Camavinga is a buy. He'll sell for 3.5 as well, um, very easily. That's a more nice profit there. Um, 
Yeah, into the fourth method now that you want to do. Um, one I like the look of sometimes is new team of the week. So obviously, there's ones that are in team of the week now. Um, you want to obviously check what the team of the week is. So you get the foot bin like I'm doing now. I'd find the team of the week. So I know that in this team of the week, um, you go to squad team of the week 24. And I know there's a few different 84s in this team of the week that I'd probably snipe. Um, those are different positions that you can probably do. So I'd be picking one that's pretty popular. It's like going to be packed a lot. So I'd be picking like Diaby, someone like that. He was 90k. He's got a chance to come up quite a lot. Um, so move to Diaby special. But the thing here is the trick is he's going to have. He's got loads of other special cards, which is good because you can put in like 90k. And you can scroll through now and try and find the deals on him. So if you look at 90k, there's only the one 85k and then 90 as you say so no deal there really and then you can go find one that's like cheap and like fodder so Castiles for example is 37k and 87 rated so you go in here now he's now 35k he's dropped a little bit to what it says he was go to 38k you'll see here there's loads of them so you want to try and find basically that meet point so 35k you want to try and get him for 32k or less um, that's basically the target um, for that Obviously, if none do come up, then you just move on to the next method. So let's say that hasn't worked. You'd move on to the next method, um, which obviously will be the final one of the video, which is going to be as follows. You want to basically go into here and I'll clear all that. And then put in for me right now, the silver prem method is very good. I mean, if you look at the prem prices, look at this. They're like 2.7k. They've dropped a little bit. Maybe 2.3 now. 2.4. Yeah, 2.4. So 2 4 is the cheapest one. I mean, it's Musunda as well. Look at this guy, 5 star skills. Should just check him to see he's not going for anything more or less with him being that sort of um, stat. Uh, no. So then we're going to go and buy. You can buy that long if you want to. Sell it on for 2 5 if you really wanted to. People are actually that desperate and are doing that. <laughs> so it's up to you, obviously. I'd go for like 2k and under. Um, me just sit and refresh on repeat over and over again until you find a deal. Obviously, we don't know when the deal's going to come up. It's roulette, basically, as to when it does. But, yeah, um, I hope you enjoyed it. If you have, please do drop a like. A sub if you're new as well. It would be appreciated. Any questions, I'll be able to reply to the comments then probably the day after. So make sure you do keep your eye out for the reply if you do ask a question. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time.